Hey friends, it's Brittany. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another part of the Sims 4 Pack Legacy. We are back. Aspen does not look very happy with her life, just in general. Sorry, my nose itched. Um, but yeah, she doesn't look very happy. She just kind of woke up. She feels very uncomfortable because she's got the energetic lifestyle and she just hasn't had time to do anything um, athletic, I guess. I don't know. But right now, she needs to go take care of her babies. And I gave the room a bit of a makeover. I wanted to use the nursery kit, so I gave the room a makeover. I really like it. I think it's super freaking cute. The only thing was weird is that I couldn't put a trash can, like, on this changing table. Like, it. I tried to slot... Because uh, I tried to slot the one that we had before, but I was like, okay, it's CC. Maybe that's why. So I got another trash can, and then I tried it, and it wasn't working. So I just put one in this bathroom. That way we can just quickly drag things in there. But, yeah, it wasn't working. So I have the new rug, the cribs, obviously, the changing table, the little diaper bag, which is super cute, the play mat. I have these mobiles above the bed, and then the toy box over here. And then the blocks, too. So I had to change their wallpaper because the flowers just wasn't going... Well, it was the flowers are more purpley and this is more pink. Um, but right now we are taking care of the kids, which is what we always do. We're, don't take her to work. You can't take her to work. It's not bring your kid to work day. Yeah, no wonder you just reset, dummy. Now the baby's stuck on the stairs, which is probably the most dangerous place for her here. Look at it. She's playing with her dolls. Oh, they're so cute. I love these girls so much. They're so cute. Hi, Bailey. Oh, Bailey loves sounds. Okay. Do they have all their quirks? So, Bonnie also loves sounds. She's a self-soother and she hates being held. Blair is a free air tinkler, an early riser, and she hates being held, again. And then Bailey is a happy spitter, a snuggly sleeper, and she just got her third one. She loves sounds. I love that. Oh, Bonnie just learned to clap. Good job, baby. Oh, she wants to go play with her blocks now. I really wish she could learn to crawl, because that would be a lot faster, babe, than scooting. Is she going to come play with her sister? Oh, she's going to come talk to her. Well, yeah. babble. <gasps> Look how cute she is. This is so cute. I'm sorry, but I love infants. Look how cute they are. Oh my god, I don't like the way she just scooted. You don't have to be that close to your sister, baby. Oh my god. Look at her. She's kind of creepy. Aspen finished a task early. What should she do? I don't know. Listen to music? Performance gain small. She can't even get a promotion because... <gasps> She's got the pincer grasp. Bailey did. But she can't even get a promotion because she doesn't have one skill up or something. Uh, Tonight at 7? Probably not because I don't even know who you are. Yeah, she needs to get her logic skill up. So... Okay. Let's maybe get put to bed by Jenna, have a little bit of a nap. Is Abby here? She's not. You can definitely tell the difference. Bonnie went right off to- Oh, she, I can have her blow a kiss. But Bonnie went right off to sleep, but Bailey's a snuggly sleeper, so she definitely did not. Oh, look at her eating her toes through her little footy pajamas. There she goes. She just learned to sit up. Aspen, do you have a moment to chat? I'm literally at work. Yay, you can sit up now, though. She's using her diaper after I just changed it. That's so... That's that's a baby for you. Okay, she wants to go play, though. I don't want the girls to sleep for very long, or else they won't sleep tonight. Oh, Blair just got the pincer grasp, too. Aspen gets home from work at 6. So she's about to come home. Let's have Jenna go change Blair's diaper. And then I'm gonna wake... I'm gonna wake Bonnie up and let's go give finger foods to Bonnie. She doesn't like yogurt melts or banana slices. Let's see if she likes peanut butter puffs. 
She wants to flirt with Harvey. Isn't Harvey a man? You're you're not into men, babe. Someone's got a reminder of that, apparently. She doesn't like peanut butter puffs either. Jesus. She doesn't like anything. Oh my gosh, she's got mastitis. Oh. No. Okay, well, let's try Odeos then. She doesn't probably like any of them. She's definitely going to be a picky eater. Do you like them? She doesn't like them either. I love how they slowly push it off. She likes mashed peas, though. We'll give her some mashed peas. Well, she loves them. She's a little weird. Alright, anyways, we need to wake you up. Who's... Oh, Jenna's in the bath. Okay, here. Let's, um... Get finger food. Wait, is it... Okay, yeah. Bailey's been in here before. Get finger food from Jenna. She's not tried any of these. Let's try banana slices. She's so cute. Clapping. Okay, let's give her a kiss. Do you like them? Okay, I'm guessing not. Let's maybe do some tummy time with Bonnie. She did get her first finger food. Didn't tell me if she likes them, though. She's so cute. Oh! Oh! Oh. Yes! She just learned to creep. Good job. Her hunger's, like, not going up at all. Stop playing in your food, Miss Thing, and just eat it. Get put to bed by Aspen. Let's see, will Bonnie actually stay in her crib? Oh, bless you. Let's try first baby food with Jenna. And I'll give her some sweet potato puree. Are you coming? There she is. Okay. Asher just aged up. A little late, babe. Okay. I should probably soothe her to sleep, too. Not that I, I probably won't even work because she's such a snuggly sleeper. Oh, she's pissed. She's furious. She's so mad. <sighs> Yummy. Is it good? Oh, she's so cute. I know I say it, but like... Infants are so freaking cute. First food. <laughs> Yummy. Oh, she's so precious. Oh, Bailey got to slept through the night milestone. How cute. Jenna needs to come feed Bonnie because she is starving. Just give her a bottle. Oh, she's breastfeeding her. That works too. Oh, good morning, Blair. She's so cute sitting up in her crib. Don't go too far, Blair. I think you still need change, too. Okay, perfect. Go ahead and put her down. Yeah, you need your diaper change, too. After she eats, I'm gonna have her go... She's too uncomfortable to do yoga. Go do the half moon pose, then. I don't know. Why is she even... Oh, because she ate spoiled food. Yeah, that'll do it. That will do it. You can put her down now. Sending a little money your way. Thanks, Mom. I don't really need it, but thanks. Look, they're talking. How cute. How cute are they? Blair looks like she wants to come wiggle to the music. Okay, mom has to go to work, though. Look at her! Oh, she still needs a little bath because she's got... She's so cute. She's got uh, food on her face from last night. This is so cute! My god. You could never make me dislike infants. Oh my god, is Bonnie coming to do the same thing? Jenna's coming to check on her girls. I wanted to go check out some of the- I can't. I'm literally at work, mother. Oh. Bailey's just in here by herself. 
Can I have her do tummy time on her own? I can. How about you do some tummy time? Oh my god, they're so cute. Mm, probably don't put her by the open flame. Oh my god. They're so cute. Why are you picking her up? What? Oh my gosh, she's practicing standing. I want her to open up Cupid's Corner. We need to take a picture for it. Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Help I'm doing all the wrong things. Look how cute she is. Oh, there's my ex-girlfriend. Let's do this. There's a gnome in it. Oh my god, this is so cute. Is there a gnome in it again? No. Okay. So she's a perfectionist. She's a yoga lover. She's an adult now, correct? I think she is. Okay. Let's look at the matches. So we have Melissa, which we already know Melissa. We have Leanna, who's pregnant. Marielle. We know Marielle. Natalia. Oh, I already saved her. Juliet. She's so cute. Sally, no. Daphne, of course. We already know Daphne. I love that I already saved Natalia. Oh my god, and Andy's still on here? Take Andy off there. Okay, so we have Zoe. Anne, Mart. Judy. Leanne. Brianna. Dana. And Destiny. Okay, I don't want any of those. That sounds terrible, but I don't want any of those. I like Natalia. Let's, uh, see if she'd like to go on a date. Hey, Jenna, don't mind me just asking someone on a date. Okay, let's do a get-to-know-you date. Uh, we're gonna do be friendly, be funny, food and drinks, because I think I'm gonna go to a restaurant. Let's see... There's the green vegan restaurant. Where do I want to go? Do I have another, any other restaurants here? Or like in the save? Okay, we're just going to go to the green vegan restaurant. I think I might need to place some more restaurants down in this save. I don't know. Okay, let's get a look at you, Natalia. Oh, she's, she's stunning. Natalia K. She, I don't know if she's from the gallery. I wasn't really paying attention. Okay, let's, um, let's come ask about her day, and then let's not brag about our babies. Let's ask about her career. Yeah, Aspen's attracted to her. That's not surprising, because she is pretty stunning. She's unemployed. That's fine. Um, what's the temperature? Is it not telling me the temperature? Am I just thinking of Sims... Three? I must be. Okay, whatever. Let's just go sit down. Did we request the table? Aspen, request a table. Seat me, uh, Briac. Hello? What is happening? Okay, well, whatever, I guess. Is there... Let's come over here. I guess we're just going to grill something. Not her getting her bike out while still in the restaurant. I'll grill us up some food. I don't know if she's vegetarian, so... I'll probably make something that's vegetarian safe. I'll make some baked potatoes. Why not? What the hell just happened? Oh, someone's dying. Who cares? Who's dying? Oh, maybe it was because he was dying that it kept glitching out. I don't know. Okay, let's grab a serving together. No! We don't need to go witness the death. Why is it just so difficult to do anything in this game? Why are you grabbing two? I mean, you do what you gotta do, but like, get to know her. 
Probably not vent. Can you sit? This date is a disaster. Okay, Aspen, I know you're getting tired, but like, we're just, we're still on this date, babe. Let's tell her a joke about aliens. Share some personal details. I don't know what that means, but we'll see. Anyone I know getting pregnant? Oh, Melissa just got pregnant by Andy. Okay. I mean, the date's going fine. Did they get a replacement over here? Looks like they did. His name is Walker. Okay, well, the date's basically over. That was okay. Did she just get tissues as a reward? I feel offended by that, actually. I'm just going to take my baked potatoes with me. Thank you very much. Can you clean up after yourself? She didn't even eat these, so... I'm taking them, too. It's fine, I guess. It would have been better if we would have actually got to, like, sit down. But she kept she kept trying to leave us, so I don't really think she's that interested in us. Granted, someone was dying, but, like, I doubt she knew them. I've, I always say it, but thank God Jenna's here. They actually all feel pretty fine, but they definitely need to be going to bed. So Jenna needs to come put them to bed. Oh, she wants to get into a relationship. Yeah, we kind of need to anyway. So I'm thinking, does she have work today? She does. She gets home so late. Maybe we should take the day off. We only have one vacation day left, but let's take a vacation day. And let's go back to sleep for a bit. And I'm thinking maybe we'll go on another date today. Probably not with Natalia, even though she is gorgeous. I'm going to have Bonnie try yogurt. And we'll see if she likes that. I kind of doubt she will, just because she's been disliking every single food she's ever tried. Except for mashed peas. She loves those for some reason. Hooray for being free from being put down. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Bonnie is enjoying her own space and is now on the loose. How cute. She doesn't seem to be absolutely despising it. So that's a step. Looks like Jenna smells. Got an extra ticket to tonight's game? Okay, I didn't even get to accept or deny that. Andy and I are best friends. Fantastic. She's like, Mommy, get me out. Okay, let's explore food with Jenna. Let's have her try some yogurt, too. I'm really curious, actually. Did she like it? Sometimes it doesn't even let you know. She does like yogurt. Okay. At least she likes something. Oh, she just blew her mom a kiss! How cute! And let's actually get some finger foods from Aspen. She's unsure about banana slices. Let's do some yogurt melts. Oh, it looks like little one's using her diaper. So cute. Do you like it? She was unsure about it. Of course she was. Who's calling? Do you have a moment to chat? I can chat with you after I feed Bonnie. I'm just giving her some breast milk because the food that she had didn't like, bring her hunger up all the way. Did she like that? Did she like yogurt? She does like yogurt. Let's try some applesauce. She's blowing raspberries. Looks like Bailey's enjoying it. She's unsure about those yogurt milk, but she's enjoying it still. She's unsure about applesauce. Okay, well, she can go get a bubble bath from Jenna. Jenna also needs a bubble bath. Asher spread some goose juicy, a go I almost said goosey, juicy gossip about Melissa. Isn't that his daughter? That's not who I meant to go to. Oliver, Devin, Melissa, yeah. Maybe he's just, like, telling her, like, how she's doing. I don't know. Okay, let's clean the lint tray, dry the laundry, and then wash this laundry. Let's also clean Bonnie up because she's got food on her face. I think this will get it off of her face. I don't actually know. Let's see. Did it, did it work? Is it off of her face? Thank you for looking up. Okay. I think I'm gonna have Jenna come explore some yogurt with Bailey for a little bit. Yeah, you can definitely go eat because you're so hungry. Okay, we have Kala. We have Megan. Megan's cute. I like her pose. 
We have Clara. Clara's cute too. We have Rebecca. She's cute. We have Lexi. Lexi's cute. Tatum. I love your name. And we have Hermes. I thought Hermes was a boy's name, but you know, what do I know? You know? Okay, so let's get rid of Natalia. I really liked Juliet too. I think I kind of want to go on a date with Juliet. Okay, we're here. Let me look at you, babe. She is really pretty. Okay. What do we have to do here? Not a whole lot. We could go play basketball if you wanted to. But let's, like, actually just talk to you. Um, let's come in here. Ask about your day. Is there a chess table here, you think? Because she does need to work on her logic. Ask about her career. Usually people do put chess tables at parks. There is one. Let's go. Play this together. You want to go play chess? Do you think chess would have counted? No, I was going to say as a board game, but I don't see why it would. And then let's tell her a joke. Uh, about vampires. We also need to share our interests. Discuss interests. And then ask about her favorite author. I don't know. Does she, does she like me? Does she think that's hilarious? Apparently she does. Y'all are doing a whole lot of talking and not a lot of... Not a lot of um, playing. Okay, I'm gonna have them actually play now. And then they can queue up talking if they want to. Are y'all playing? No, they're not. I was gonna say, are y'all playing footsies under there? But they're not. Julia is really cute. She needs a makeover, but like... I like her long braids. I still kind of think that Jenna is endgame. I thought that Yvette was going to be in game, but I think it's Jenna. I mean, I don't know, like, it might not work out, but I don't know. I just really like her and Jenna together. So, I don't know. It, it might not even be Jenna. Who knows? So, we'll make funny faces. This date seems to be going a lot better than the one with Natalia. Oops, that's not where I meant to go. We'll do another impression. She loves to swim. We should have went swimming. No, I don't want to extend the date because we're we still have plenty of time. <laughs> oh no, Jenna left. I'm pretty sure the babies age up in two days. I think I'll have to see. Yes, they age up on Friday, which is a little sad because they're such cute infants. But I'm excited to see what they're gonna look like. Lexi's calling. I don't care what you're doing. Let's maybe go watch the sky. I don't know. I still feel like that's maybe not something you would do on just a get get to know you date, but what do I know? Are you attracted to her? Oh, she's Aspen's very attracted to her. That's not surprising. Aspen's attracted to like everyone. Oh, we just got money from our day off. We need to do a deep conversation again. Do you think we should... Oh, let's ask her if she's single, actually. Are you single? She is single. Okay, perfect. Okay. Let's just give her a compliment. Bold pickup line. There we go. Cute. Let's not tell her we love her. I wanted to compliment her appearance, too. The date is just about over. Okay, that didn't count for some reason. Whatever, I'll just ask about her day. Maybe we can say that that's her asking about the date. <laughs> Tell her a funny story. Not us being able to- Whoa, look at our romance. All we did was do a bold pickup line and then compliment her appearance. We're so close to getting a gold event. We only have 30 minutes, though. I don't think we're going to get a gold event. Just because she needs to tell another story. And I don't think she's going to get it finished in time. But we'll see. Okay, you have like 10 minutes. Did you finish it? She did, and we did it. Yes. Okay, she's getting up and walking away. That's fine. Our date's about to end anyway. 
Yay! That one went a lot better. That one definitely went a lot better. I think I'm gonna end this part here. Y'all, in the next part, we're gonna have three toddlers. I'm, I'm sad because I love them as infants, but I am excited to see them as toddlers and just kind of get to know their personalities a bit more because as of right now, Bonnie, like the main thing that I know about her is she is a picky eater and Bailey, Bailey is, she's very hesitant, so she's very cautious. I think cautious would have been a good trait for her. I don't know what she got. I don't remember. And Blair is kind of she's kind of the quiet one, I feel. She's, like, not, I don't know, she's not as clingy as ba or Bailey, but she's not as, like, not, I don't want to say annoying, but she's not as needy. That's not really the word I'm looking for, but you, you know what I mean. She's not as, like, annoying as Bonnie is, for lack of a better word, but I'm really excited to see how their personalities progress. So I hope you guys enjoyed this part. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.